Here we go. And we are live. What's Cardinal up, Sun. everybody? Live. How's everybody doing? Hello, hello. What's everybody up to? How's everybody doing today? Awesome. Getting nibbled on by a kitty. Yeah, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> nibbled on by some pussy. All right. What a way to start your day. Why well, well, not? Good old pussy nibbles. Who's out there so far? Um, I did see, um, in case anybody is wondering and you're watching the beginning of the show, or you're watching the replay, make sure you PM Eric Sutherland. He is giving away drops of multiple varieties. All you have to do is look at the chat prior to the show, and you'll be able to see that. I thought he was just giving away the stainless ones. I must have missed that. It, it might just be stainless, or maybe that was just what he was giving away at that time. But by the sounds of it, he does have a whole mess of them to give away. Yeah, if we get a choice, I'll take a black one, please, Eric. I'll take that gun metal. I'll go with rainbow. I'm just it matches everything. I, I'm not picky. I'll take whatever you send. I, yeah, I do like... I do, I do like... Go ahead, Brush. I was going to say, I do like my gun metal one, Eric, so if you just want to give me more of the same, <laughs> I'm okay. Just in my camera. Just get- if I can just get one with good O rings, just that's all I want. Is it, uh, all of them have the good O rings now? Yeah, the new ones. Yeah. Let's see. We got who's out there now? Nate thirty eight. So crates. The zebra is in the house. The zebra. Church is in the house. What's happening, Church? Um, Eric, we of course know because he's Oprah tonight. Um, Rufini's is out there. Raven Shadow Vape. Scott Black Cat White Face in the house. Train so Scott. Well, what else is out there? What's up? So, vape. Maybe Taurus. Scott can get together with Eric, and Scott can put builds and all the uh, drops that Eric's giving away. Oh hell yeah! There you go. Ooh, that's a win-win. If that starts happening, count me in. A co-op oh, yeah. of free shit. That's, that's right. right. Yeah. Oprah Sutherland in the house, everybody. You get a drop. <laughs> you get a drop. Who else is in no, here? I'll even pay for shipping for that shit. Vapex is out there. Papa Vapes. Um, Cam Man's out there. What's happening, everybody? How's everybody doing this fine, fine day? By fine, fine day, I mean it's a short fucking week. It's a Memorial Day. Hopefully everybody took a moment to uh, thank all of those who lost their lives for our freedoms this weekend. Not just to get fucked up and have a good time. Although, I did partake a little bit myself. However... You still got to take that time to thank them. So uh, I worked. Yeah. Uh-huh. You know, in your profession, you guys don't really get many days off unless you set them aside I ahead could. of time. Yeah, I get Thanksgiving and Christmas are guaranteed. The rest of it, I get a book. Well, at least you get those guaranteed. Um, I know some people who drive that those aren't guaranteed. Oh God. Yeah. Yeah, I've I've been home for every Thanksgiving, every Christmas in twenty three years, twenty two years. Can't complain about that. No. Nah. How was everybody's weekend? Did everybody have a good three day? It was all right. Four day. Oh yeah, that's right. You lucky bastard. <laughs> Work for the yeah, government. I had, to take leave. I had to take leave for one of the days. Ooh, that's right. No longer in uniform. You're paying for it. That's right. That's all right. The, I ended up having to use two hours of PTO because I work at 10 on Mondays, and the company will only pay out eight hours of holiday pay, so I have to use two hours of my own PTO to cover the extra hours. Fucking cocksuckers. All right, that's out of my system. I feel better now. I would have gone and worked for two hours. Fuck them. They don't pay told, me enough I to totally go do that. And besides, I have so much fucking... PTO saved up that it doesn't really matter at this point. I can do two hours in my sleep. All right, meter. I, can, I can, but you know what? <laughs> I, I honestly, I just don't want to. I, fuck, they know I've actively been looking for a different job for the last couple of years. The only thing that's keeping me here at this one now is that I'm working at home. That's a big thing. It, it really yeah, is. Huge benefit, yeah. That's the only thing that's honestly keeping me to where I'm not looking as hard as I was. I mean, if I find a government job, though, 
Deuces, I'm out. If I can be making the same amount, fuck it. Deuces. I know my local post office worked this weekend because I received a package from Bull City Flavors on Sunday morning. Sunday. Ordered for <laughs> that's that's the nice thing about living in North Carolina. Ordered Friday night and got it Sunday morning. Can't complain about that. That's nothing wrong with that at all. Hell no. Especially with free shipping. You know, speaking of ordering things, um, I did order something new as well. A little change of pace for everybody. In case you haven't picked up on this yet. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Look at that guy. Look at that. He's hey. not sitting in a room full of fog. Two days shipping. Thank you, Amazon Prime. Yep. How you how you liking the how you liking the upgraded uh, upgraded rig? I like it. That was a probably that was a really well spent fucking seventy five bucks. Mm -hmm. yeah. What model's that one? Nine thirty, wasn't it? Yeah, the nine thirty E. Yep, it doesn't right. tax your computer. That's the great thing about the nine thirty E. And Same thing I got. the best part is, I can already tell just from fucking around with it over the weekend that. I don't think there's going to be as much of a lag issue between this and OBS yeah. now. So I might not be quite as bad on the Ninja movies. However, that um, very yeah. well could um, still happen because my computer is still garbage. Oh. But the plus side is just from watching here, because you know how OBS tells you where your CPU usage is at? It's dropped from 40 down to 35. So uh, I lost um, 5% off that. So. Plus, apparently, the eyesight camera in Max chews up a lot of fucking RAM. Garbage. Yep. Do you hear me, Apple? Fucking garbage. <laughs> I love my Mac, but fuck, that pisses me off. Well, if you get a, you can get a web camera. There are web camera controllers I've found now that work really well with the 930E because I spent some time doing it. So nice. So there are those out there, and you can actually run that. Before the show, you run it, find your settings, save them, and then just close the thing out. It doesn't eat up anymore, and your camera remembers the settings the whole time. Uh, I, I did a little one-on-one -on -one this weekend with Meter, and we got that all squared away before I hand. That's why it's framed the way I want it right now. <laughs> I'm not all <laughs> fucked up. Otherwise, it would have been showing all of my fucking room back here, and you'd have seen fucking hot mess of shit I have in here. Hash, what's happening, buddy? What's going on? How are you? Not too bad. Yourself? Ah, it'd be better if it was fucking Saturday, but you know. I can't complain. So, how's, uh, how's the Crohn's treating you today? Are you doing better? Much, actually. Yeah. Thanks. Uh... No, things are good. Uh, just actually had a really, really um, impressive band practice after not having it for two weeks. So uh, um, we flew through both sets and also started working on new material. So we'll be ready for our show on Sunday, uh, Saturday of next week. So golden. Nice. Yeah. Uh oh. Dr. TMI says he can now see the grain in the paneling behind me. It's time to fucking paint that shit. <laughs> Apparently it was better without the bad camera. <laughs> I like that this camera does a lot more with less light, too. Yep. Yeah. It's just, I, a, it's just a really nice camera. And I've just got the two lights I already had. One here in front of me and one up behind me. You see the little black pole there? Another light. <clears throat> the, the one thing that's different is you're not as vapey as you were before, though. So it takes a little away from it. That's because there was a whole fucking <laughs> section of the camera like this that was covered in fog because it somehow got between the glass and where the ice sight camera was. Oh, shit. And I'm not pulling off the fucking cover for the LCD screen because I don't know how to put it back on. Or take it off without breaking it, to be honest. 
I was just kidding around there. It's good. It is what it is. You just don't look like you're clouding it up as much as before. I know. It's kind of a bummer. I did kind of like that super quality effect. <laughs> I might have to find a little uh, filter for the camera for that nature. <laughs> How everybody thinks it's back to normal. Well, it's popped in here since the last checked here. I think Taurus is in here. Oh, look at that. Paul Subhuman is in the chat. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> that guy from that Dixie Chicks cover band? He's in a band, yeah. Dixie Chicks. <laughs> Whatever happened to them? They said stuff about the president. They sucked and disappeared. They went to Europe. <laughs> I thought maybe they grew up and became hens. Hesh, you were laggy as F. <laughs> I know. He's going to make it look like there is Chinese movie stuff happening. Oh, shit. Hi. Yeah. Hey. We just want you to keep doing your hand, your hand like this. <laughs> I think doing his hand like this is what got him lagging to begin with. I saw a couple of haulers oh. come through here earlier. They had Brantley Gilbert on the side of my ghost. Is there a Kid Rock concert around here? I think they're touring together this summer. Are they? Hmm. Probably. Yeah, we're going to we're going to Sam and Raleigh in September. It was one of my wife's birthday presents for my daughter. So again, my parents can party. We're gonna have a good time. You can't click on that. I know you can't click on it. It's not a real link. I'm going to buy that domain and then have a click through link. <laughs> all your promo shit. It's just a redirect. Hell yeah. Stand by while Leafa directs you to stand up 3D. Stand up 3D penis.com. Click here to subscribe to my website. <laughs> it's not hard to find my website <laughs> <laughs> or is it Carol, where you um, wood tick mike is in the house wood tick mike is gonna get a whole bunch of e-liquid soon and i see juan castillo popped into the house as well God, juan. He, fist, he fist bumps everybody yeah. there you go Julio. uh oh is it turkey oh Hesh says he has to go restart his router. Apparently, he's having um technical difficulties. Get a brown up. Right yep. on. AKA porn won't close. Heshical di difficulties. He's going to load the stream with brown trout. <laughs> Did you say heshical? Said <laughs> 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 like. What is vegetables for? <laughs> oh, come on. Ivana's rubbing on the keyboard that's sitting over on the side, so I, she keeps <laughs> popping windows up on me. <laughs> <laughs> and you want more pop ups for hot pussy now? Click here. <laughs> yes. Meow. Yes. Hot cat on cat action. That's like, wait a minute, Ivana. I'm not sure that. Not sure the female cats like the hat, the hot cat on cat action. <laughs> I mean, it's the internet. There's a corner for that. Yep. They have that uh, office furniture sex uh, website. I remember that from a few years ago. <laughs> well, we learned on Sunday that cats know how to fake an injury to get attention. That was so funny. Oh, I mean, she shut that shit down fast, and I was just like, "Oh, I hope the cat's okay." Then, when the vixens came on, then I was like, "Yeah, cat was faking it." Yep. Cats are cats are devious little bastards. Like people think that. Yeah. People think that kitties may not be that smart. They, they almost have human equivalent brains. If, like the cat faked an injury to get attention. Yeah, I don't like just this. Limping, cat limping the around house. the room, wouldn't put her, wouldn't put her foot down. Just limping around the room. I'm like, Fuck <laughs> you. <laughs> the second she got all the attention that she wanted, back to normal. Mm -hmm. Plotting. Kitty's plotting on shit. 
And my one cat pulled a stunt like that. She did a couple times, and we thought maybe because we were away for a few days and came home, and a cat's limping around on, you know, three legs. I'm like, what the fuck? This cat, like, jumping off of shit and getting hurt or what? It's always when we leave, and then you'll see her walking, and you know, she'll be walking normal, and then she'll kind of look, like, look back like, oh, shit, I'm busted. And then she'll start limping again. I mean, a cat weighs like two pounds. I mean, I'm pretty sure a cat could take a fall. It's not that much weight. My cat does. Uh, she fakes. She fakes puking, but she also has stomach issues. But she knows that when if she makes that noise, that I'll come hurrying over to see what's wrong. So she, oh, she'll yeah. just sit there and start making the noise. And it's like, where's the cat puking? Where's the cat puking? Motherfucker! <laughs> you get over there. Gotcha, bitch. There's a kitty over here. Well, Barry's in the house. Oh, what up, Barry? Hi. Hey, hey girl. Barry. Loop and that, all kinds of people are dropping in now. We're getting there slowly but surely. So, what's hey. that, what do you got planned for the short week? Work. Uh, we're having Stefan Didak on Friday. I don't know what we're doing yet Saturday, but nice. Friday, I know. I'm fucking bummed I couldn't make it on Friday. I was planning on doing so, but my parents decided they were going to show up to my house a day early. They were supposed to be here on Saturday, Mom. Surprise! Motherfucker. <laughs> was yeah, not ready week. for that. Yeah, this week we're doing gummy bear recipes. Fun. Are you going to use the uh, king? Uh, no, nah, I think I'm just going to go over to uh, one recipe I did with TFA gummy candy and the other one with uh, 27 bears. 27 burrs. That's yeah. actually a really good flavor. I get a slight pineapple off of it. Like it's just a plain white, you know, almost translucent gummy bear. So it makes it good though, because then with that, you can build around it easy. When that's <clears throat> like wet and doesn't have the dust on the outside. Yeah. I mean, I'm not sure if you run it up high enough, it'll get dusty. You know, you'll get that uh, dry note, but. <laughs> you get that super loose. Oh, yeah. yeah. Is that your dog, Waylon Jennings? <laughs> <laughs> Just about to ask who the hell Waylon Jennings was in his house. It's just a good old boy. Never mean it, no harm. <laughs> just a good old boy. Humping the wife's arm. <laughs> oh. Foot fetish. Yeah, that's about it, Wood Dick. <laughs> Apparently he likes between the toes. <laughs> so if anybody out there is looking for a sub ohm tank, I hate sub ohm tanks, but I'm loving this arrow tank that came with the Geek Babe Legend. The Arrow Legend. Or the Ages is it, Legend. Is it from the CW? Nah. I think it's WB. I picked up what you're putting down there. <laughs> My son just emerged himself into the whole Arrow universe. Where he's like, oh, we gotta watch this one, and then we gotta watch this one, and then we gotta watch this one. <laughs> I rewatched uh, Legends of Tomorrow. It's fucking brilliant. The rest of the rest of them, uh, the Flash is pretty good. Arrow's okay if you like Batman. Um, yeah. Flash is pretty good. Play the Flash is pretty good, but Legends of Tomorrow is fucking brilliant. <laughs> Did you guys oh. see that story about that guy in France that scaled a building to save a kid that was falling? Yeah, caught the kid falling off the balcony. Yeah. Oh yeah, that dude's awesome. <laughs> 
Did you yeah, see the he, father standing right beside him that didn't do anything when the kid was right there? That was the neighbor, not the father. Yeah, yeah. the father's actually being brought up on charges. Yeah, the father went to the grocery store, left the kid home alone, and then went out playing Pokemon Go. Oh, Jesus that was Christ. the neighbor that had caught the kid. The kid had already fallen two stories before the video started. Shit. That neighbor oh, caught shit. the kid on the fourth story, and dude climbed up four stories of fucking balconies and brought the kid in. Yeah, that dude's a fucking hero for real, for real. <laughs> Later, Adam. <laughs> Be good, Hash. Later, Hash. <coughs> Be good, homie. Good luck. Yeah, good luck with that internet bullshit. Know what that's like. Oh, pretty soon, uh, Eric Sutherland's giving away a Falcon Sutherland tank because he picked up a second one. So, whoever was next in line. I mean, I left my drop at work. I really did do that, um, Eric Sutherland. I don't know anything. But how good is the Falcon? Is the Falcon supposed to be good? I mean, I don't really do tanks, but, I mean, if Eric Sutherland's giving out free shit. Oh, yeah. I know, right? If Eric Sutherland's giving it away, I feel like it's going to be worth checking out. That's right. I mean, he's growing his beard back after all. He's trustworthy again. Yep. <laughs> Once this came back into play, you know he's back in the game. That's right. <laughs> oh, we do got some good news. If anyone is members of Vape Shack, um, at 8 o'clock tonight, we started the uh, second season of Meme Wars, where you <laughs> take pictures of your favorite shack members and turn them through photoshop or whatever means possible and make a great meme out of them <laughs> i'll see yeah, if i can i can pull up the one that i made earlier and i hope i hope bob's watching Bing. You, can tell, you can tell doc is on summer vacation <laughs> Kids are not in school anymore. There we go. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Fun stuff. Good times. And if you're not a member of apeshack.org, I strongly suggest you go over there and get yourself a membership, hang out in the Zoom rooms. A lot of some good stuff on the website, a lot of inf good information. Just don't let Doc send you a new e-liquid. Yeah, don't do that. <laughs> yeah, 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 that, yeah, that'd be a bad idea. Bad for business right there. <laughs> yeah. He always sends you a bottle of good might, stuff with it. Yeah, Vegemite is not your friend. Thirst Roman is not French for licorice <laughs> no. no matter how many times he tells you it doesn't matter if he's an educator or not <laughs> is that what he's calling himself now <laughs> i was giving him the benefit of the doubt oh he'll educate you <laughs> he gonna learn today <laughs> he's gonna learn, learn today son. son whether you like it or not all right uh, it's just right today. Cracked up in the steeped, not from concentrate. Ironically made from concentrate. Yeah. It's funny how that happens. I giggled when I made mine. I'm like, <laughs> I'm making not from concentrate from concentrate. <laughs> I'm breaking all the rules here. <laughs> yeah, like, it feels weird. I feel like I violated myself. <laughs> yeah. And it was okay. Yeah, just, but it was still weird. Yeah. I just remixed uh, Not From Concentrate and Banana Bondage and put them in the steeping cabinet. Interesting. Oh, the Falcon is supposed to be the best mesh sub home tank. All right, line me up for that there, uh, Oprah Sutherland. The best. The best. Well, if that's the case, tomorrow I need to drive down to the shop to get one. Because if they say the best. Around. Now... I'm hoping it's the best of the best of the best. God damn it. Fuck. Now it's stuck. Yeah, now it's stuck. God damn it. 
<laughs> Fuck my life. Oh, man. Uh, the only thing better than that is the song like some 90s band made. It's called Sweep the Leg, Johnny. You gotta check that video out. It's got it's got him in the trailer. He's got his buddy that does the get a body bag, and he's like freaking bald with a hairline right here. <laughs> it's got all the guys from Cobra Kai sitting in this trailer out in the middle of the desert. No, I just started watching the the show on uh, YouTube Red the other day. Oh my god! It's, like it's, it's awesome. everybody. It's everybody. You're just like, no, there's no way. It really fucking is. And you're like, what? How did this fly under everyone's fucking radar? It's so good. It's so it, good. It really is. I think we uh, blew past it in like like one and a half days. It's like, I got to see the next one. Yep. God damn it. Now I'm going to have to go and watch that too now. Fuck. Yeah. You got a good way Cobra to Kai? Cobra Kai is really... I, I watched, I've only watched the first two episodes and it, it made me go... YouTube Red, you okay? You finally caught my attention. Yeah, like I, I really want to see this. Yeah, definitely. So, mm, let's see. I've got let's see subscriptions to like three other things. I don't know if I need to add YouTube Red to it as well. <laughs> You've got another way to find it. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. There's other ways. You know a guy that knows a guy. Uh, yeah, there's other there's other ways to see it, but legally to support the show, absolutely you should check it out on YouTube. Red, everybody, something you enjoy. Yeah. That's right. Do the right thing, because there's plenty of people that don't. Well, this so the is person that we have the person that we haven't seen in chat for a while is that Bobby Wayne. He like won a bottle of thirty mils of sloppy seconds. We haven't seen him since. Apparently, he didn't like it if he didn't come back for more. <laughs> I don't know, man. Or maybe he's hunting down the recipe and he's mixing it full time. It's a, yeah, Bobby Bobby Wayne liquids. <laughs> Has one liquid. Fuck you. Key lime pie hey, goes like, goes like Greek yogurt. It's a party. <laughs> Shouldn't have made that public. Oh. <laughs> it's so good not to make it public. So good. Almost like when it touches your lips. Uh, so what do we got going on out in chat tonight? We got people out there. Oh, the zebra wants to know whatever happened to Fake Link. He did drop off as well. True. Yeah. And it, ironically, he dropped off after we started offering him prizes. I know. I know, right? That's the weirdest time ever for a troll to just disappear. Like, he won free stuff. <laughs> he, he was guaranteed free stuff. Rigged. Yeah. Rigged. Rigged. Yeah. Like his troll heart grew three sizes that day. He's going to get his address. <laughs> He put all of the stuff back under the tree. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is funny. Whatever did happen to that son of a bitch? <laughs> There's a couple of those going around for a while and then they just pay. <laughs> Fucking tail died as a doff and called it a day. Yeah, that's. I haven't seen my favorite troll in forever. I don't know what. I don't. I hope he's out doing wonderful things to the internet. Undertaker. Yeah. Yeah, it's surprising. You know, I guess it does happen though, because even I can tell just in the couple of years that I've been doing this now, the amount of change that I see between people that stay and come and go. I mean, there's a lot of people that are still here from the beginning, but on the other side of that, there's people that have kind of eh, moved on to bigger and better things. I get it. Life goes on. Different right. strokes. 
Uh, yeah, they got better. They got better people to. They got better people to harass than than us. <laughs> no, fuck those guys. I got better things to do. I get it. <laughs> They're over making fun of those oyster shuckers or something. <laughs> Poor Poodle Pearl. <clears throat> A purple one. Ooh, pretty colors. <laughs> Someone else we haven't seen. Hardly ever is a finger banging fat chick. Oh, crazy. well, would you see that? Um, apparently, <laughs> Smith and Freddie both know who Fake Link was. Huh. I would gladly take a private IM to know who the fuck that person is. Actually, you know what? No, I don't want to know. <laughs> I like the anonymity of it because you know what? That motherfucker's English was bad. Just bad. So I enjoyed that. I don't want to know I who think, it is. I think Fake Link's English was purposely bad. <laughs> I sure hope so, because, man, some of those things I was reading, I was going, third grader, third grader, there's a third grader. It's uh, just a third grader. Uh, you're saying Candy King is made in China. But well, they are. More power to them. They donated $62,000 to fund the suit. Yep. Yeah. They just donated a shit ton of fucking money. So you, get a, you, get, you absolutely get a free pass, Candy King. That's yeah. right. Oh, where is that at with the numbers? Have they reached goal on it now? Yep. Yeah. I think nice. they hit, yeah. Thanks to Candy King. Nice. Candy King them over the top. I like to think that it was the Addy's yogurt money that really pushed <laughs> them over the top. Yeah, that Candy King chunk was nice, but it just got them like almost there. And then that Addy's yogurt money was like, here you go, sir. And it just like spilled over the edge. You know, exactly. <laughs> and confetti popped off and like naked girls started dancing behind the scenes. You know, that brings up a really good point with how fast that money was raised. Because that was in less than three weeks. Yep. That they managed to do that. Think of if everybody in the community did that for every piece of advocacy we needed. Well, a lot of people, what came out a lot of what you saw was what we were saying before that, you know, the consumers have done, have done their part. The consumers have absolutely 100% done their part, getting it as far as they did initially. And all of a sudden there was call outs from like fairly decent sized names in the advocacy world saying, Hey, stop giving money. It's, we need that. We need the companies to give the money because they're, you know, we're defending them. So Hurry up. <laughs> yep. Well, and to that point, Inikin was one of the first people that I saw. The second anybody said it's time to get the companies involved, Inikin yep. fucking jumped. I very much like to see that because they didn't get asked. They just stepped right the fuck up and said, well, let's lead the charge then. There's exactly. something like that for that realistically in a situation what where they, want, they wound up giving like 10 grand or something, didn't they? Yeah, if I remember yeah. correctly. Yeah, yeah. Inikin, Inikin really stepped up. Candy King, who would have thunk it? Yeah, right. I remember, I remember, six to, it was like 68,000, 62 Holy or 68 shit. that they gave thousand dollars. Yeah, that's huge. Oh, fuck, that's more than I make in a year. Oh, that's fuck. But I mean, to be to be fair, I mean, they've, they've been hard, you know, ever since everybody started bad mouthing their liquids, everybody's been vaping them. So, yeah, they got a lot of attention off of it. <clears throat> you, you owed us, Candy King. You owed us. Like I said, you get a you get a free pass for all your all your bullshit for a minute. And, and they did change their labels. Yeah, they cleaned up the rack. I mean, I think any money that anybody gave for it, including Don collecting the money for Addie's yogurt and all that, it's all great. It all counts, and it all means just the same. Yep. You give what you can give, and you do what you can. Uh, Nate, uh, that's the thing. Oh, go ahead. I was gonna say Nate thirty eight corrected. It said Inakin gave twenty thousand. Nice. And it was no, sixty two thousand from Candy King. Sorry. No, no, no. Just show. No, I was, I was gonna say that's the thing about this community though is when there's a call to action and people need to step in, the community does that. Yeah. You know, whether it's, you know, next week, uh, Abby's doing her 12, you know, doing a 12 hour live stream to raise money for, you know, kids with cancer. So it's not always just vaping stuff, but there's the vaping community. Like last year, Wayne Walker <clears throat> did one for St. Jude's Children's Hospital. I mean, it's, there's always something going on, and the vape community always steps up for as bad of a name we get in the general media. You know, we're always the first one there to help out when it needs to be done. 
Yep. That St. Jude's that St. Jude's telethon he did was amazing. You know what? That oh, kind yeah, that kind of makes me think of us kind of like bikers. Uh, biker gangs. Who's always the first people you see doing stuff like that for kids with cancer? Biker gangs. We're a biker gang of the vaping variety. Fuck it. We all need t-shirts or, or vests. Can we get vests? Maybe we should. I think we're going to have to start getting vests now. Putting vape patches on them and shit. <laughs> That's right. This is my mech mod patch. That's right. <laughs> This is, my pink, this is my pink pussy patch. Say something about it. I dare you. See, right here, motherfucker, I'm a member of the Purple Army. Mess with that. Right. Strictly unregulated. I'm a one percenter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a point. I'm a point oh eight percenter. <laughs> <clears throat> it kind of reminds me of the three different cars in town I've seen at the grocery store where have the, they have the 0, 0.0 stickers. They say 0, 0.0, I don't run on cars. <laughs> <laughs> three different cars. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Only if we get scooters? No. See, I can't do scooters. I, I'm. Last time I got on a scooter, I was trashed and ended up wrecking it. This ain't gonna fit on 49cc, fella. <laughs> I, I think mini bikes, like those guys with the world record holders, the mini bikes. <laughs> Talking about like the Shriner bikes? No, like, remember the <clears throat> the two fattest twins? That, yeah. Those guys held the record forever. They were on the little mini bikes. Made them look even bigger. <laughs> Fucking like the, would they have them on like little AC, 80cc dirt bikes? Yeah. Ones that are made for your toddler. <laughs> With some beep, deep beefed up suspension. I mean, more like a 2% black current patch, Raven Shadow. <laughs> I made 2% black current. What's up? <laughs> and flavor art, not that TPA bullshit. <laughs> What's that? Looks like Reader's Dog learned how to hump too. Red Rocket, Sprocky, Red Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> If we weren't age restricted, we are now. We had a penis on the show. <laughs> Whoops. Dad, give me your love. <laughs> it's my show now. What's up, bitches? Oh. Okay, meters in the middle Gosh, of a threesome. Yeah. <laughs> it's a dog pile of threesome. <laughs> it's a dog pile, dog pile. It's a dog pile, dog pile, for sure. Don't Google him and search that. <laughs> <laughs> I got the fresh from the kitchen biatch from the golf tea coil patch. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh. That is funny. I'm going to have to um, go get myself a fucking paper bag and do a test run with a paper bag vest. And a couple little drawings. <laughs> so what else is everybody in the comments doing this evening? You guys aren't very talkative today. I mean, you're talkative, Shilling. but not quite as talkative as normal. It's pump day. Pump and day! It's fucking day. Fucking genius day. Fucking genius! Jesse, you got quiet once we went live. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> yeah, you're being all aggressive earlier. 
It wasn't being aggressive. Was, like ready to fight people and shit. I'm, calling, I'm, Jer- I'm Jesse. Want to fight? Like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, dude. I'm calling fucking malarkey. <laughs> malarkey. You say shenanigans one more time. <laughs> Speaking of which, I still need to watch that second movie. <laughs> Although I'm, I'm afraid to watch it because I'm afraid it's going to be a flop compared to the first one. I mean, I know it can't be as good, but which one? Just the... Super Troopers two. Uh, I've heard great things. I, mean... I still want to see the sequel to Beer Fest. Oh. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> Das Boot. When they walk into the, the festival with Billy <coughs> Nelson working the door. Yeah. Do you boys like marijuana? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, no. So crazy. He's out there. He needs somebody to come over. He's delirious. I know, right? Yeah, is anybody there with you? Is anybody Tell the there lion you have seen things. <laughs> oh, shit. Go see your um doctor, quick. Greatest Wednesday night show. I'm like, what's on? <laughs> Hell yeah, James Capozzi. Capozzi's got a chub. Capozzi's going to get a shit ton of used e-liquid. That's awesome. Is that abused or non-abused? I was gentle. There Plus, there's sloppy seconds in there. So, you know. That was mighty fine to get life out of it, to, throw in the, to throw in an actual prize along with the, the, the cast offs, <laughs> as we want to call them. It's here, you can have this graveyard and this one special thing buried down way bottom and bottom of the pile. You just keep digging, you'll get there. It, they didn't have to pay a single dime for it. Exactly. Sure not. <laughs> There's they, they just picked the right number. There's a there's a here's how we're gonna run it from now on, everybody. He's going one of the empty bottles. One of the bottles is going to originally be empty. And he's going to fill it up with it with uh sloppy seconds. And it's up <laughs> to you to figure out which one is the sloppy seconds. <laughs> <laughs> it may be in the butterscotch RY4. Who knows? You never know. <laughs> Oh man, poor Mophead. Mophead wins. Send him the butterscotch RY4. Yes. Does he have Soho? He has Soho, right? What? Probably. Does, yeah. does he not like that flavor? That's a that's a RY4. <laughs> he probably doesn't. He thinks uh, as RY4 is like a wet cigarette. That's what he thinks it tastes like. Yeah. There's. I don't get I that. Get out ca- of I get caramel. I get caramel with. Yeah. A, I don't savory. get any type of tobacco. No, yeah, it's like a savory caramel. I, I get like yeah, like it's, the savoriness is I, I interpret it as kind of tobacco leafy. A little bit. <clears throat> I, I love I love that butterscotch reserve so much. I made my own recipe. Huh? Church says supposedly if they made enough money off of Super Troopers too. They're going to make pot fest. Oh, that's awesome. So Lupus package is shaved like his head. Surprise. Well, you know, you'll know the package is in your mailbox if you see a lot of T-Rex tape. <laughs> I see all my boxes with T-Rex tape. Good luck getting into that, fuckers. <laughs> I'll seal it up with T-Rex tape, and then I, I tape on my little paper address label that I did with more T-Rex tape. <laughs> I think you should, start, you should start wrapping it with saran wrap also to, to give it some added protection. Saran wrap the fuck out of it and then tape it. I was going to say use a blow dryer on the saran wrap. He drink that like shit. Lamin- <laughs> yeah, laminate that shit. <laughs> Shrink tubing. Everything inside it's shrink tubed. 
<laughs> Why and then wax dipped. Yeah. There you go. Happy giveaway. <laughs> that's pretty. That's pretty fucked up. <laughs> It'll only take him a week to get into it. I have made a challenge to anyone who has not had the original. Is I like Taurus? the original. I don't like uh, extra crispy. What are we talking about? Oh, I like extra crispy. I like original. Uh, original. Oh, glass basics. Yes, is that Taurus? Yeah, he uh, he put a video out today. He uh, he remixed my recipe of the uh, butterscotch R Y four. Has Vape Taurus had the glass basics? No, I think he just took it from my description. I don't think oh. Taurus has ever had commercial e-liquid. I think he just went straight to DIY. Well, right, Taurus? It's not a bad route to go. I don't remember. Yeah, they, one of these days we'll get golf tea on the train. I'm close. And then he'll start. He'll come over and start hanging out with us on Saturdays. And Mrs. Golf Tea's just going to be pissed. Yeah, she will be. True. Willie Nelson isn't getting any younger. Nope. Not by any means of the imagination. Evidently, we're we're our our sounds are not matching our our mouths again. All right. Why? This so is exciting. Huh. It's so exciting. Apparently, it's gotten ornery with us. Fuck it. It don't matter. I think it's just something going on with Jesse right now. I don't think the rest of us really have to worry about that. One, two, five. Besties. I skipped. <laughs> Hello. Let's see if that worked. Uh, easy rider. I hope everything's okay. Hope everything's good Take for you, man. Take her easy, brother. We'll see you the next time. Oh, okay. So Chora says it's, he's seen everybody's review of the, the class basics. Mix them back in your I would not mix with your ear. You get earwax in there, and it's it, it would just be bad. Yeah, probably not the greatest idea, but hey, I guess uh, whatever floats your boat, sail away. I mean, as long as others don't have to try it, go ahead. Let us know how it works out. I mean, it, it's all in the fine tuning here because if he's got gauges bigger than mine, then he could I could easily fit a fifteen mil bottle in this motherfucker and then just like lean over and count drops at a time. <laughs> like mixing my ear could be a legitimate challenge. Let's not jump to conclusions here, gentlemen. We don't we don't judge out loud. I don't know who you're talking about. I judge out loud all the time. Fucking Let's take Jesse. a moment of silence to judge real quick. Fucking Jesse. <laughs> See, he told you. I judge out loud. I'm not that way. Fuck it. I'd rather talk shit to your face than behind your back. That's not my way. <laughs> I'd just rather do it in my head because I'm funnier than what I'm going to say to you. <laughs> That's the truth. Hello, Jennifer Jarvis. Hello, Welcome. Jennifer. Hello. <coughs> yeah, Taurus, Jesse doesn't really have jokes. Please don't laugh at him and encourage him any. It's not being helpful. Don't feed the wildlife. <laughs> Which one's that, Meter? Is that another grapefruit? Mm -mm. It's the orange. That's the watermelon. Watermelon. <laughs> uh, they had a blackberry shandy like right before I quit drinking. I remember it was pretty solid. That I would very much like to find. I don't think they make that anymore. I haven't seen it. I, I should know. Uh, they've got every variety of wine and kugels in Wisconsin being as it's made here, so I, I haven't yeah. seen it. You're a little closer to the source than I am. Yeah, just go up to the lining plant. And, <laughs> and it's, what is it? From a mouse in the bottle, eh? She's about <laughs> two and a half hour drive, maybe three hour drive from here in Chippewa Falls. 
It's a cool plant to tour. I remember doing the Alaskan brewery tour. Like there's not a, the tour doesn't go very far. Cause it's like, here's the room where you can walk in and buy beer. And then they walk you back and there's like a, uh, plexiglass room that you walk into and you can see all the workings. And then the guy sits you down and like plays a video and he's like, so there's free beer back in the other room. So when you run out of beer, just go get another one. <laughs> and the tour is like eight bucks and you just get fucking trashed. Yeah. Because you right ba- basically got that. two hours to drink as much Alaskan Alaskan beer as you can. That's a good two hour tour right there. Yeah, it was it was fantastic. I got hurt somebody's wallet in two hours left unattended. Oh yeah, no, because they have said they have they usually have some uh like really, really expensive stuff that they don't ship out of Alaska. Oh yeah. There, there was one I drank. I, I took a drink off of it, and I, I felt the alcohol kicking. And I was like, How, "What's the fucking percentage on this?" Right. And I think there's places well, in Alaska that they can't even drink. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah, most of it. <laughs> that was one of the few times I ever saw my mom just get shit faced. It's fantastic. Because <laughs> she's like, "Can you grab me another one?" I'm like, "Oh yeah." Yeah. What's that one? What's that one that I just had that I get that I just caught a buzz off of one glass of? Yeah, give me two of those. Here you yeah, go, ma. Double, double fist that shit. No, you one for me, one for ma. Here you go, ma. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Somebody's driving us back. The cruise ship's right there. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go back and raid. I'm gonna go back and raid that 24-hour buffet. <laughs> I'm gonna do some damage. You better have some pizza up on that Lido deck. I'll tell you what. <laughs> you go for that midnight uh, dessert buffet. Mm-hmm. Oh, dude, the going on a cruise ship and like being a little bit insomniac at the time was fantastic because it was just, I'm like, I'm bored. I'm a little bit hungry. I'm gonna go see what they got. You go wander up, and they're just like. A lay a line of cheesecakes that weren't there that wasn't there two hours ago. You're like, yeah. All right. Oh, ice cream. There's ice cream. Yeah. That's all that. you can eat. Oh, you need spaghetti, sir. <laughs> Let me cook you some spaghetti right now. Yeah. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah, that'd be bad for me. Yeah, then go hit the casino and Yeah, the twenty four hour casinos and 24 hour, 24 hour buckets of beer. Oh, yeah, it's 24 hour everything. Yeah. We're in international waters, motherfucker. We can serve it anytime we want. Yeah, and I would go, yeah, and then I would just grab whatever I was doing, go sit on the deck. Nephew nephew and my mom passed out. Just out there with my bowl of spaghetti, bucket of beer, cart, cart, carton, of, carton of tax free cigarettes. Watching the sun come up. Yep. <laughs> Holy shit. 80 milligram pill of oxy? Jesus Christ, how the fuck did that come up? I don't know. Yeah, I think I missed a memo there somewhere. Taurus, <laughs> what show are you watching? Do we all have live chat on? Saturday, homie. Oh, you know what? I, I don't, actually. <laughs> but nothing changed. Go figure. <laughs> That's right, or o- o- church. That's right. In Alaska, how can I oh, get it's four hundred dollars for it's four hundred dollars for eighty milligram pill of oxy. Jesus fucking Christ! Who the fuck is on an eighty milligram pill? That's enough to fucking kill a horse. Yeah, this <laughs> big. Right, those are the ones that look like fucking uh, altoids. <laughs> Crush them, crush them up, and snort them like little teeny razor line at a time. Yeah, baby it's rails. Smarties. Chris says, Chow needs Fix a bomb. In with your smarties, pixie sticks. Chow need a bump. Oh, fuck. You said something about price in Alaska. Is that the going price in Alaska? Because I'm sure we could probably get a script filled here for like. 15 bucks on my copay but make out like bandits in Alaska. Right. You only got to worry about that whole um, 
traveling across state lines and international. I'm, the, I'm an international. Yeah. And... I was gonna say I'm an interna- I'm an international waters motherfucker. I snuck that. I snuck my. I snuck my oxy in, up my butt. I'm part. I'm partying when I get to Juno. Fuck off. <laughs> Welcome to Juno. Uh, I'll see you here. That's All right. right. Where's the nearest restroom? I got a, I got a little, I got a little present for Alaska. <laughs> Ten bucks for a gallon of milk in Alaska. Can't they grow cows? No, they freeze halfway down. Well, it's ice milk. It's good. Uh, Ten bucks for milk would be surprising. It would be a, well, it'd be a little surprising. Like I said, the the five dollar foot long. There ain't no five dollar foot long in Alaska. Nope. You don't even really see them hardly anymore. Yeah, no. Well, six dollars. I think it's six dollar, yeah. and they change it every day of the week. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> but um, yeah, up in Alaska, it's like it was like fourteen bucks last time I was up there. So for any foot long sandwich, and it was like it was like it was five or six bucks for like an americano. Jesus. Yeah, Alaska's Alaska's expensive. Everything you're. That's right, TC. Everything's expensive up there. Yes. Beautiful yes. though. Just stunningly gorgeous the whole way up. Hell yeah. I wouldn't mind doing another cruise up to Alaska. Who wants to go vape cruise? Vape cruise. All in, Amer- all in America treats vapors pretty good. You can vape on your deck. You can vape on your. You can vape up on the back of the ship. That's about it. That's better than most cruise lines though. Yeah. Take your stealthy vapes. <laughs> oh yeah. <clears throat> I remember going and hanging out in the casinos, not gambling at all, because that was the only place on the cruise ship you could smoke inside. Because it was so fucking windy and cold out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing Benny's. Yep. No, I just wandered around, found a chair, sat down for a while. A little bit of cigarette. They told me you can only smoke in that part of the casino, so I walked over to that part of the casino and stood in the corner. Son of a I say we just go to a Mexican all-inclusive altogether. Take That'd over the place. That'd be fun. Going like December when the temperatures are actually decent. Yeah, you go to like Cabo San Lucas and get some tequila. Well, we all have to right. just. You guys, take can, you guys can all. You guys can all drink. I'm gonna go look for the snorkeling. <laughs> We all take our ages with us. That way, we can be on the edge of the infinity pool. Not worry if you sit down on an accident. True enough. Yeah, be good. I threw my, I threw, I threw mine in the toilet. <laughs> you made it through. And I hit it. Well, the only thing we can't go golfing with them. That's all I got. That's all. That's the only thing you can't do, really. Yeah. Like you can hit it with a katana. That's fine. But. Take a take a wedge to that thing. I think with a driver it would be okay, but the wedge you just you get that blade just right and it shredded it. Yeah. So it's okay off the tee, just in your short game, you don't want to use your aegis. Nice. Well, maybe if you use a sixty degree and you get underneath it real good, you'll be all right. Yeah, but if you hit it if you catch a thin shot there, you're gonna put that thing in half. Uh, yeah, and if you hit it <laughs> Fucking worm burner with an Aegis. <laughs> <laughs> it says I topped it. I fucking topped it. <laughs> the chip's going one way. <laughs> the screen's going, uh, uh, going the other way. Babe Taurus, I did a uh, cucumber basil lemonade. Turned out wonderful. Um, the basil, it's like a sweet basil flavor. So it adds like a bit of sweet green to whatever you're trying to do, so it works really well with fruits. I'd say add some onion, some tomato. Is that the flavor of basil? Yeah. yeah. It's a really nice flavor. You do it at like you do it like a quarter of a percent. You don't want to go too hard in the paint with that stuff, but it's, uh, it's a really nice flavor, actually. I really enjoyed it. I know Mary Beth has it. I haven't picked that one up yet. Maybe a couple drops of liquid smoke in there. What's that? What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Holy shit. 
Is he lost? Or is he found? Yes. Is he beer is he is he telling us telling us that the the, the king of beards is here? Apparently. Yeah, I see that. What's up, Swaggy Jane? Swagalicious has returned. Hey, welcome back to the neighborhood. Man, Ooh, coming out of the woodworks. <laughs> Crazy, it's just popping out. Well, no, well, it's Wags in the house. Guess we can go back to um, giving away his shit. <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking with you. Oh, man. Well, for, uh, man that's, Black doing weird things in the, that's doing weird things in the camera there. Taurus wants <laughs> to know if it would mix with uh, Favora Blackberry Blossom. Um, Blackberry Blossom is... Are you experienced with Blackberry Blossom? It's not what you think it is if you're not. They're both liquids. They mix together. I mean, yeah, it'll mix, but um, they were blackberry blossoms, more floral than anything. So it's a nice, it's a nice enough flavor. I, I wouldn't just do those two. <laughs> I'd put some mint. Mint and spearmint in there with it. Hopefully it stays that way, Swag. Hopefully it stays that way. <clears throat> Gorby's in the house. Late to the party. He was probably waiting in line again for fucking an hour and a half before he decided to show up and say anything. What's up, Gorby? Being as he does have a tendency to wait in lines for no reason. Oh. Gorby, I'm not letting that die, ever. You should not have been standing in line next to me in Detroit. <laughs> You've used it once or twice, yeah. Then, um, I mean, if you want to enhance the green, go for it, man. I would, I would probably use it. I would probably use it even lower. Basil mint would be nice. Hmm. Basil mint and some blood orange. Ooh. Mm. That does sound good. There. Put pet in the kitty. She's just blood orange, caramel, and spearmint. Huh? Yeah, me thinking in new ways to fucking. Blood orange and caramel, yes. Yeah. <laughs> spearmint, right on top of it. And spearmint? You gotta add like that kid at the toppings bar at the yogurt place. Okay, this is good, and this is good. And then you're like, okay, that's where we stop, kid. Nope. It's cookie dough. <laughs> go ahead. No, no. When, when kids hit the Sunday bar, it's like, go for it. Do whatever the fuck you want. That was, yeah. I took my son that's to one of those. one way to learn this life lesson. <laughs> I took my son that's to one of those cream, for the first time. <laughs> I took my son to one of those for the first time this last week here. That's exactly it. Ooh, that, and that, and that. Like, I shouldn't have even got you the fucking ice cream. I should just give you a bowl for fucking toppings and called it a day. Bowl candy. Yeah. I want gummy bears and gummy worms and cherries and kiwis and cookie dough. And I'm going, Jesus Christ, kid. That is just a horrid combination, but whatever. Fuck it. Have a good one, Eric Sutherland. Eric, oh, wait a minute. Why are you leaving? You haven't finished your giveaways yet. Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, where's my falcon tank? Yeah, no shit. Get back here, Eric. Where's my tracking? Yeah, where's my uh, strawberry rhubarb with a little basil? That'd be all right. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, experiment. I need my track. I do. I need my tracking. Eric Sutherland. That's right. Did, did did any of his drop winners get their uh, get their tracking yet? Yeah, so, for sure. X one, if you got your um, tracking from Eric Sutherland. 
If I see more than two, I'm going to be furious that I didn't get mine yet. No, no, we got tracking. Yeah, um, our word delayed two minutes. It's it's delayed pretty good. Oh, black hat, black hat, white face is supplying aliens. That's very nice of you, black hat, white face. Man, mm. Scott, what a good guy. Fuck. He is a great guy. I'm not sure. I'm not. I don't think that your aliens are going to fit in the uh, Falcon tank, but you can send me the aliens. I'm, I'm all right. Okay. Oh, he's he's going to send Yetis aliens. Oh, you're um, gonna send Yeti? I've got a bag. I've got a baggie of those. I mean, what do yeah. I need that for? I got a baggie of those too. I, it's not ne not necessarily necessary, but I'm not gonna say no. Yeah, I'm never I mean, saying no to aliens. Uh, not Rock. to mention, I think that if somebody else sent them to me, it'd probably get here faster than when Yeti sends them to me. <laughs> Ironically enough, I I just got a message from my wife. She said that she heard from Yeti that. <laughs> yeah. uh, well played, sir. Well played. That was fantastically played. <laughs> nice. Meter the king, the king of going out in style. <laughs> I think it was Hesh needed backup TP, so Meter had to go. And making a run to uh, make sure the. Browns made it to the Super Bowl, all right. Yeah. <laughs> Hit the like with your face. No, don't. Your computer monitor will fall over your desk, and mm. that would be good. I, if you're into that kind of thing, be my guest. But um, we are not liable for anything that happens to your computer when you do such things. Just a little disclaimer. Yeah. More bodily injury. Yeah. Bodily injury, I'm all right with. That's your own fucking fault. If you got a soft head, it's your own fault. Freaking ambitious vapor. Ambitious vapor got the Pirate King RDA. Yeah, motherfucker. <laughs> I want that RDA. That's what you should. Uh, that's what you should have. Uh, should have asked. What's their faces for? I don't see it on their site. It was the first thing I looked for. I'll yeah, let them know I haven't heard from them in a while. It'd be nice to hear back from them every once in a while. Hey, guys. Hey, fresh, fresh says hi. Who? <laughs> oh, fresh, I, fresh, I don't think you want to hear what they had to say. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> TC I just heard. cracked his phone. Thanks, Taurus. <laughs> yeah, great. I, I reviewed everything you guys sent me. That's all I'm saying. And just stopped. You have too many things. <laughs> what do they play like the middle of the road guy until they get too big and then they're like, we don't want no more part of this because he wants too much <laughs> stuff. And they got so many different uh, stipulations with your review. They do. They it's not hard. Review. It's not hard. It's like over here, instead of like the Leafa logo, maybe over here, we got to put the Gear Best logo. And then you got to put twenty tags into your into your video. But done. Um, do, they, do they give you specific tags? No, they just they said twenty tags. If you need help, we can provide them for you. I would have said yeah. yeah. Yeah, sure. Provide them. I for me. have tags. I put weird tags in mine, like sushi, tuna, um, rice aroni. The San Francisco treat. Yeah. You never know. If you put those tags in, somebody's looking up rice aroni. They pop on one of my videos. They they go, hey, that looks awesome. I'm not going to smoke anymore while I make rice aroni. I'm going to vape. We they put Jerry there. Rice. Jerry Rice? Yeah. You can put Killer of Cowboy Killers. And yes, Freddie, congrats to Yeti on um, getting on the resistance crew there. Freddie, Freddie, I'm not sure what you guys were thinking. That's all I'm really <laughs> that's all I really gotta say is I'm not sure what you guys were thinking letting him in there, but Yeah. It's mighty cool of you guys. 
Mighty cool of you guys. That's right. I think he has a little bit too much rage for that group. I know. They're a pretty chill group. Pretty chill group, folks. Like he's just going to bring the rage quotient way up pretty soon. It's the, the rage distance crew. He's going to get the... They all go and talk to Yeti, and he gets all raged up, and then they send him in. Go. You're in. You're in. Go. Philip, is that a question or is that a statement? What is it? <laughs> looks like he's got it as a question, but the way it reads out looks like a statement. <laughs> I don't see what the fuck you're talking about. The hello. What's up, Philip? Oh, Miller? okay. I see it now. Jeez. Freshy. Yep. Hi, Freshy. Hello. <laughs> Freshy? Question <laughs> mark? Maybe he's confused then if it's fresh or not. It's a good thing. I'm here. I promise it's me. I know what these guys. That, Jesse? What was that, Jesse? Why would he be fucking Chucky? <coughs> what? what? Hashtag fucking Chucky? What the hell is that? Wow, how long is the delay? They're saying goodnight meter. Oh shit! Uh, he just. <laughs> oh, okay. They're talking about the tags now. They talked about. <laughs> yeah, there is a good bit of delay there. Fuck you, YouTube, and your shitty delays. Bye, meter. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Deuces. Uh, they, yeah. yeah, they played their notification game on my show last week. You had a good show going, and everything. Next thing you know. Like, 20 extra people showed up right when we were out trolling. <laughs> I had one the other day. Notification came through for the Saturday show. Monday. Mm -hmm. Somebody goes, you're live. I'm like, no, I'm just here in the shack. No, you're live. It's pop-up Saturday show. I'm like, really? <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'll get random notifications for shows that were you know, days, days ago or hours ago and just like Really, I was. Oh. I was on that show. <laughs> that show's already over. <laughs> yeah, you keep doing all these okay. fucking pop up Saturday shows when I can't come. Fucking folks are at my house. I'm getting ready to smoke a brisket on Sunday. I'm going, fuck. Why are you gonna do this? I on just get wild hair up my ass, and I just go. All right, let's give some shit away. Pop it up. Fair enough. Usually Saturday, I'm all right because the work week is done. And I feel guilty for not having like a vapor face off or a Thursday show or something like that because work got in the way. Because hashtag fuck Spain. Um, sorry if anybody's in in the chat from Spain, not you, just the people that I work with. Um, <laughs> if I work with you, you better identify yourself. Um, but no, work's been getting in the way of. of Live shows during the week. Hopefully, Holy it'll dwindle. Holy shit, that is a hell of a delay. Because I just got the answer from Philip. It's a general hello to y'all. Right? Fucking Christ, that delay is horrid. Okay, just for you guys' record, the time here in Central Time is 1047. Tell me what time it is when you hear it. Do you have your latency set on Ultra Low? I don't know. I didn't fuck with anything. I've had it set for the same. Oh, so you've got normal. He's got ultra high. Ultra high latency. Highest possible quality. Oh, well, I sure says 1047. It's not that bad. Eh, it can't be too bad. Probably 30, 45 seconds. TC says about two minutes. For... Hey, man. Hmm. Oh, TC got it at 1048, so, yeah. Seems like it's about a minute, minute and a half or so. Yeah. It's not as bad as I thought. Eight Joey four. got it before everybody else. Yeah. Shit, Joey yeah. got it before the show started. <laughs> yeah, and congrats to TC hitting 400 subs. Congrats, homie. Let me go, TC. Keep it up. James, James wants Wait. to know where GTF is parked so he can come visit. Erie, Pennsylvania. There you go. 
It's going to be a little bit of a drive for you, James. I know your address now. <laughs> yeah, TC, uh, I didn't see a giveaway video yet. Uh, you need to get on that. He says, in other words, I'm going in. Or... Video. Is he doing a giveaway for something? I don't know. It's very, maybe he would. He's saying, I'm just saying, but you should probably get on that is what he's saying. In other words, he wants to come in and you get away. <laughs> he says, I'm not begging, but I'm begging. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, Frank's almost all out of e-liquid. Oh, hell no. I'll never be he out He doesn't want to give away in the next 10 minutes, so it ships out, then he won't have any e-liquid in the future. He says, and can you please overnight that for me? It would be greatly appreciated. You know what the difference between regular standard and overnight is? I priced one today. The difference of seven dollars and fifty cents to forty nine fifty. Oh, fuck you! You can wait. <laughs> and it's yeah, right. not guaranteed at all. It's like we'll do our best to get it there overnight. Yeah. No, no, no. I want to know the exact minute it's going to arrive at the dude's doorstep. Yeah, if I'm paying that much, you better fucking tell me exactly when that shows up. In fact, that better be the first thing off the fucking truck. It better be before 10 a.m. <clears throat> well, I had the, when I had to ship the liquids out, I had a couple of expresses. They weren't overnight, but they, they had to, they had to be there by the, by a certain time or I got all of my money back. Yeah. No, I love uh, the post office going there with five boxes. And she goes, hmm, this smells good. I'm like, yeah, I don't know what you're smelling. There's a whole big old mishmash of everything. <laughs> good luck in deciphering that. The rest. <laughs> Horos, you're going to win it. You're going to win an e-liquid giveaway. That's what you're going to win. <laughs> and watch this show long enough. You'll win something. Speaking of which. Um, before I forget, I do have shit to give away from the meter. Speaking of which, now's your chance, Taurus. Yeah, now's, now's your, your chance, chance Taurus. Uh, Actually, you know, I'm sure the number slots already got shit written out, right? Number slot. Hey, number Me? slot. Yeah, there's no other number slot in here. Not yet. He's actually 3D printing them. They'll be done tomorrow. <clears throat> you see this? Three of them. Hurry up, number slot. Let me know when you're ready. Is it this plus this? <laughs> Look, we went over this yesterday or last week, and you still haven't told me. Is that your IQ or your legal number of white parents? I said both. Oh. Well, at least we know. Hey, Jesse, do you still have a wrench in here, too? I know your wrench disappeared in Gizzard Stew's channel. Oh. Yeah, he, he he didn't know how that happened at all. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Jesse posted a link to his website before the show started, and then, boom, he didn't have a wrench anymore. Jesus well, Christ. It was, it, was that yesterday? Or I was going to say, because I know last week, you know, YouTube was being all crazy with no. wrenches and crowns. And, That's not what happened last night. Yeah. Somebody <laughs> got a little too big for his britches by the sounds of it. No, I did what everybody else does, I did, does and I just lost my wrench for it. I don't. Uh, I really don't understand how that happened. YouTube's got to be fucking with you. It's probably back. You probably got rights back now. Yeah. Or unlikely. <clears throat> it was probably just having an off day. <laughs> I pissed in the wrong thing out there. <laughs> well, if anybody wanted to know why Paul decided to drop off, I just pasted the reason. And he will see you all Friday on Fresh Show. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I meant to place right there. No, I don't think Giz took it away. He was too he was too concerned on running the entire show. <laughs> yeah, there's no way there's... He, gets, he gets way too flustered to, to multitask when he's pushing the screen. <laughs> 
Yeah, Gizzard did not. I, I guarantee one hundred percent. Gizzard did not intentionally take your wrench away. <laughs> oh, I don't know what happened. I was just fucking around. Whether he did or not, I don't really care. Life it, knows. Kung, life does know kung fu. It doesn't change the fact that it was gone. Kung fu and about four other. Chinese you're gonna have, you're gonna have to wait about a month and a half until he's having a really good show and he's really calm about it, and then you can ask for it back, Jesse. <laughs> But it'll it'll be you just pay attention on the show. Be like, does he seem like he's okay right now? <laughs> yeah, Bob uh, Life's going to be on his channel on Friday. Yep. Yeah, he had to double dip this week. He had to do Project Fog. He has to do Fog Life. Oh, uh, we're having uh, Roro vape with me on Friday night. So, if anybody has some really messed up, weird questions, you can email those at leapofbabes at gmail.com. <laughs> I have one come up that's like, if your dog pooped a perfectly shaped turd in the shape of a banana split, would you take a picture of it and share it with your uncle? <laughs> the picture. Of those the are the turd. questions I want. Oh, that's great. Hey, look at that. Dimlin's out there. What's up, Dimlin? How you doing, girl? What up? You ready to vote on Monday? Oh, no. Oh, no, Dimlin. No <laughs> is the correct answer. Oh, is Dimlin in San Francisco? It's San Francisco area. Oh, nice. Jesse, number slot. Are you ready? Yep. All right. You guys know the drill. One to 100 and go. First number is 42. 11 teen. What? <clears throat> hey, there's Bob. Where's Bob? Bob who? Bob Benson. Oh. Ah. Man. Yeah. Well, like a mofo, she says. You know, this fucking moths that are banging against the window right here are really starting to piss me off. I keep hearing, tink, 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 tink. <laughs> oh, fuck, apparently I need to put up shades here so that way those chops yeah. starting to fly towards the light here. Poor little tink, tink. Poor little tink, tink. Yeah, both Chicago style, early and often. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Just load up a truck. Come on, guys. We're going voting. That's right. Grab homeless people off the street. They're allowed to vote in California. <laughs> I got Burger King for sandwiches. You got to vote. She says she doesn't get to vote in San Francisco because she lives in the suburbs. Yeah. Mm. Ooh. You should have thought ahead. Got a fake address. <clears throat> Yeah, there's a lot of people that do that. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, they just... really don't let people do that that live in the suburbs? No, because it's just a city of San Francisco vote. Yeah, yeah, the city of San Francisco, the actual city of San Francisco is not very big. No. And it's kind of like, uh, technically I live in Green Bay, but I don't. I live in a different township, so it's, but it's still... The Green Bay area. Yeah, Green Bay it, Post it's, Office. Yeah, it's just it's the same concept to any big city. There's call still it, a bunch of Packers. Like you think Milwaukee, there's a bunch of little towns around there like Wauwatosa and other things like that. That technically they're not Milwaukee. It's just that little small portion. It's just everything's built up around there. It's like going to yes. New York City where you've got Staten Island and the Bronx and everything else. It's still the city, but it's not. Yeah, yeah here's a, a, here's, I was gonna say, here's a secret, Dimlin. Big Tobacco threw a lot more than twelve million at it. <laughs> hmm. A lot more. All right, all of that died off there. What's those numbers? Are there a number slot? The first one 
Do I have to hold them up or can I just say them? Hold them up so people can see them because I don't want them thinking this is rigged because we've already been through that once. Rigged. 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 21. 21. Bob Benson, 19. Half of 42. Ruffini's. Or, or Church has, has part of 21. Ruffini's, yep. Looks like Ruffini's one. Yep. Ruffini's. You know the and drill. Nine. Uh, nine. Are we doing Bob Barker rules? Uh, niner. Closest without going over, right? Uh, unless there's one that's a lot closer. I always just go closest, and um, if it's equal numbers so apart, then it's the one who's underneath. Closest would be, looks like, Philip Wheeler? Yep. Philip Wheeler's the closest. Philip Wheeler. Oh, Wheeler. Wheeler! All right. So we got Ruffini's and Philip Wheeler. And what's the third one? 76. There's a bunch of higher higher end numbers there. Uh, Cam Man Dan hit it on the head. Did he really? Yep. Shit, Cam Man. All right, well, Cam Man, Ruffini's, and Philip Wheeler, email me at golfteavapes at gmail.com. I'll put it out here for you just so that way you have it right. <laughs> Dimlin. <laughs> Grats, not me. <laughs> Just so rigged. So rigged. Super rigged. Uh, I think next time to make sure it's not rigged, I think Jesse should choose numbers and he has to show everybody and then they get to pick their numbers. Always rigged. So that always works. Yeah, because that's the fairest way to do it, right? That's right. <laughs> Open. We're 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 transparent here. Are we playing like yeah. um, little league rules here? No one of these. Wins, yep. What is that like the ten ten run rule <laughs> in the fourth inning? <laughs> at, at the end of it, you still get pizza. So what does it matter? That's right. <laughs> yeah. Everybody wins. <clears throat> See, that's that's kind of an upgrade because when I was playing T ball. Well, we got was a can of pop. Man. I just remember getting orange slices and some water. We had the can of pop, and you could tell which family had to outdo everybody because you know you had store brand root beer, cola, grape, orange, whatever in the coolers on the regular days, and then Mister I'm Rich brings in Pepsi and Mountain Dew. That's right. <laughs> Then you're like, I don't want that. Where's my where's my root beer cola? Where's the where's that grape? I want a grape. Mountain Dew. Just when I need more caffeine. Yeah, I just remember orange slices and a cooler water at soccer. Uh oh, uh -oh taking a boop says he, he needs a a recount or something. He said he had three. The number was nine. You had the number nine in there, Jesse? Yep. Yeah. You, you were both equally. You were both. You were not fourteen and and three. Or you're both six apart. So I guess yeah. if they were, if it's going closest yeah, without going over, then and they were the same. Fourteen's uh, yeah. only five. Yeah. So we were. My math was right. Yeah. Fresh's math was right. Come on, got to mess with the king of DIY. I'm pretty sure he's got his math down pat. No, no, I don't. <laughs> rip truck? What's a rip truck? It's a rip truck. I don't know. Huh. It sounds fun, though. Cupcakes after the game? I don't remember getting cupcakes. I just remember it was you can eat more of the orange slices that we had from <laughs> halftime if nobody, if we didn't eat them all. But I was playing in public league, so that would probably explain that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They do. No, they only did pizza one time a year for us. That was always at the end of the season. And if you won the game, maybe you got some red man. Here, you have a little dip of tobacco. There you go. Congrats, kiddo. Congrats. 
Now go behind the bleachers and puke. I remember one of my last years playing soccer, there was a kid who was 18 who had turned 18. He would run over and get a cigarette from the coach at halftime, and he would have his cigarette. Jesus Christ. Really good soccer player, though. He was, <laughs> he was amazing. That guy like Jim Daly? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> he can play. He can. Oh, dude, he had like. Had this with a cigarette in his mouth and a beer in his back pocket, then he can without oh, it. He had like a. He had this awful blonde mustache. It's like it's like a half Fu Manchu, like came down to like right there. He had like the mullet, like the like the long top and the long back. Everything else is close. Was, but like I said, he was an amazing soccer player. I think he went to college for soccer. He was just playing the public league just to keep warm for the season. You know, every time I think of mullets now, there's only two things I think of. One is NHL hockey, and the other one is the fucking vaping bogan. Uh, I still think Joe Dirt. Yeah. And, well, yeah, I guess Dirt Hay falls under that. <laughs> With his naturally white, trashy um, facial hair. Yeah. Are you telling me your facial hair just grows in all white trashy like that? <laughs> There's so many great one lines in that one. Aren't they doing two? Aren't they doing Joe Dirt too? They did do they a did. Joe Dirt too. Yeah. They already did it? Yeah. Well, shit, now I need to watch it. Meh. Yeah. It's not as good. I'm just kidding. I haven't yeah, watched yeah. it. I think the dog gets his nuts cut on the porch again. Poor guy. Nuts frozen to the porch. Yeah. This time he doesn't use water in a spatula. <laughs> he does use those forks. <laughs> oh. I think he plays with fireworks again, though. Does he? Big I don't dog. know. No. <laughs> Got snakes. Snakes and sparklers. Memory goes out in the desert and finds the Native American guy, and then you get like, then they go find. Uh, so he was one selling the snakes and sparklers, and then they go find the real shit. They bro, they blow up the crapper. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, I got the poo on me. Ping. It's just an old crapper tank. Somebody put a biohazard sticker on there. Yeah. Excuse me. Hmm. Excuse me. What's you. the new what's the new five pond, Stimlin? Crap. I wasn't talking about that. I just said crap. <clears throat> and if Doc sends you a bottle of e liquid that says five prawns, it's not the same thing. Yeah. Stay the fuck away from it. Yeah, try five. it anyway. Why not? Fuck it. Five prawns. Yeah, no, you may as well um, buy a fucking uh, authentically challenged atomizer and use that so you can throw it away when you're done. Mm -hmm. With the potato chip and chocolate? <laughs> Gimlin, you can't taste that chocolate anyway. I'm not sure why you, why you want to dry it. <laughs> Wait, did Philip Wh Willer win? Yes. Just asking. Yes. Okay. He don't know what he won. A uh, code for dirt cheap e juice. If I, if it's the normal meter giveaway. Yep. Yeah. It's a surprise. You'll get it in your email tomorrow. Surprise! Surprise! Applies. Surprise, motherfucker. No. Sorry. When you worry, get a giveaway. Don't worry about what it is. It's free. Free is good. <laughs> it's gonna be pencil pencil shaving dipped potato chips with sea salt. I wonder how they did the sea salt. I'd be curious to I'd be curious to get into their get into their plant just to learn about that. Wait, wait, that's their new real that, that's a real re recipe that they have like a real liquid. Yeah. This is a, I've, I've this is the second time I've heard someone talking about it because someone came in trying to ask us how to clone it. And I was like I don't. 
<laughs> I don't know how to do potato chip. Saline at two <laughs> percent. Yeah, you're probably going heavy on the saline. Mm, just to get the saltiness out of it, yeah. I mean, it's the only way the chocolate comes to life. Oh, poor Dimlin. I don't know that. The fact that you can't taste that you can't take uh, that you can't taste uh, the liquid bar and lava cake. Oh wow! Or the glamour just, chocolate, or any of them. Just can't taste them, or allergy, or what? It tastes it tastes bad to her. It tastes like pencil shavings. I think you can get like disability for that. That's like, horrible. <clears throat> I'd apply for it. To try to get those benefits. <laughs> It sounds like it wouldn't be very good. They say it's nasty. Yeah, I don't know. They're, they they had that coffee one that was terrible. Thanks, Crankster. They probably made a mistake and used Inaware coffee. <laughs> oh, Crankster, you're cute. And I see um, you have Bye. really bad fucking English as well. <laughs> Bye. Oh, I was gonna let him stay for a moment. See what kind of dumb shit he did. Oh, if you if you can't even come in swinging right, then what's the point? Yeah, fair enough. And when your English looks like it's not English, then you couldn't have stop him around a little bit like a cat does a mouse. Yeah. No, see, that's it's not fun. You don't play with your food before you eat it. Well, cats do, and they they think it's wonderful. Hmm. I'm not a cat. Well, just pretend for a while. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes it's better to just get rid of him right away, I guess. Yeah. He'll be back. As if um, it's something like that, he's probably got another account ready to go. Yep. Fired up, homie. Fired up. Let's go. Get those wrenches swinging. No, no, come in swinging hard. Come in swinging for the fences. Don't just come in and call us a bunch of, what do you say, goat fags? Yeah. Fag goats. Huh. Fag goats. Yeah. yeah. Come in swing. Come in swinging hard for the fences. Like, like, uh, like, um, Black yeah. Undertaker dildo used to. He came in talking about, he, he's like, he, does anyone want to see my prolapsed vagina? And see that right there, you know, that catches my attention. I'm like, why? Well, I don't really want to see it, but you've got my attention. Exactly. Huh. Dimlin is apparently in love with Rin's new kitty. It's a, it's absolutely adorable. She got yeah. a Maine Coon kitten. That cat's going to be so big. Oh, yeah. It's going to take up half her room. Oh, it's going to be amazing. Poor Momo. Momo's not going to know what to do when that thing gets bigger. Yeah, Momo can bully it right now, but it ain't gonna last long. Nah, you know if she if she beats the respect into it early. Yeah, teach it fear. That's right, teach it fear, teach it fear, Momo style. But yeah, it's absolutely gets, adorable. You know, when the cat gets big, cat won't realize that she's a big cat. Yep. What do you think, Ivana? Do you want another kitten in here? I think I'll fucking kill you, human. <laughs> and she just laid her her head on my foot. She's like, aren't I enough? Aren't I enough, oh man? I don't do it for you anymore. <laughs> I just worry. I just worry worry about going to Scotland for as long as I am. I went to Iceland, and she seemed like she was okay with everything, but. She's older, more persnickety at this point. When is the Iceland, or the Scotland trip? That's coming up here soon. Yeah, beginning it? of September. A couple months out. Yeah. How long are you there for? A week? Two weeks and some change. Well, I'm, what I'm thinking about doing, well, I'll talk to talk to folks after the show, but I'm thinking about doing something with my channel. So while I'm while I'm gone. Nice. <clears throat> that way I don't have the same the same whiplash effect that happened last time I went on a long vacation. 
where I lost where I lost half the people that came and watched my shows. Still haven't gotten everybody back. Hmm. You're gonna have to have someone here releasing stuff for you, or do a bunch of videos beforehand and just release them. And I've got a bunch of videos already already in the tank. Better ready for for something like this to happen. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be gone from the second of September, and I come back the the night of the seventeenth. Right. I'm gone for gone for fifteen days. That's a good little run away. Yep. It's gonna be awesome. Two weeks in two weeks in Scotland, and then a couple days back in Iceland. Nice. We're talking about my aunt. One of our aunts is coming along, so or one of my aunts is coming along. So we're talking about doing a golden triangle. That's gonna be awesome, Freddie. Yeah. I mean, me and me and I've already got the the room booked out there and everything. Hang out for a couple days. I still haven't heard back from that from the promoter from that convention though. Yeah. Yeah, I still haven't heard from him. That's okay. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, what the hell is going on there? Uh, yeah, DTA, DTA. So, yeah. Totally crapped out. Apparently, Leafa crapped out too. Maybe he's crapping. He could be taking the trouts down to the stream. Yeah. I'm not sure. He's probably yelling at his daughter. Restocking <laughs> the pond with brown trout. That could certainly be happening. Not so scrawny, Connie. I'd love to those places. I'm assuming you'd love to go to those places, but yeah. I'm, I, I, I do have Todd's address, so I could show up at his house. <laughs> Just show up in his shed. But yeah, exactly. I would be sitting in his shed, and I would go live from his shed. <laughs> you can go in his shed, and it'd be like a mansion instead of being like a small shed. It looks so small on video, but when you get in it, it's like, oof. It's enormous. This is ridiculous. <laughs> it's like seven floors, has elevators, goes up to all different squonk mods. And <laughs> That'd be awesome if I could if I could talk Todd into like just hanging out for a couple hours. Like, dude, I'll, bu I'll buy you some whiskey and some vanilla custard. Just come hang out with me. <laughs> Precious sitting in the corner going live. They got Dean and oh Dean, I already him. talked to Dean. He's not coming. He's just like, no, I'm petting not. the dog. Dean says Dean said I'm not going all the I'm not going all the 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 way the fuck up there. So. No, I'm just saying you go live and you know, do a live show and you know Dean's in his place and you and Todd are there and you're just petting the dog and they're doing their <laughs> Tuesday night live show. <laughs> yeah. I'm sitting off in the background just. Hey Hang boys! Oh hell, we are getting towards that time of the evening, and I do kind of want to shut it down a little bit early because I've been lacking on sleep lately. So we're gonna shut her down early, boys, tonight. Let All everybody right. say their piece and go around the room and do the once overs. Uh, I guess um, since somebody's been so fucking quiet, I'm gonna. Send it on over to Jesse. Jesse, you can have at her first. Hi, thanks for having me on. <laughs> no. <laughs> that was, was that was that good enough? No. Um, as I always say, remember to support the people that support us because they need support too. And um, do what you can for advocacy. Not if you want to, but because you should, because it's healthy and it's awesome. And that's it. There you go. Who's next? Frank. Frank. Hey, everybody. <laughs> get over to uh, Armageddon e Liquid, get you some of this nightshade from uh, Ducky's line. This stuff is amazing. Uh, we have less than three weeks left, guys. The uh, comment period from the FDA. We need to get on it. Uh, Cole Bishop didn't go as well as we had hoped, uh, but we so, so we have to, you know 
can't be complacent. Got to keep swinging. Uh, New York people, they're talking a flavor ban. Uh, if you're in New York, actually, uh, you can, I think that one's kind of open nationwide to uh, go ahead and uh, support our vapors up in New York to uh, make sure that doesn't happen because, you know, that's another one of them key states that what happens there ends up happening around the country. Check me out to uh, 2 p.m. Eastern Sunday. Mixing in the kitchen. I'm doing gummy bears this week. Mop head. Uh, I think Mary Beth's. Yeah, Mary Beth will be there this week, I think. Yeah, and Moose will be back this week. Alfredo will be hanging out. So come join us. Learn something. Thanks, TJ. Appreciate it, buddy. Thanks. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Battle. What's happening? Uh, so this Friday, we do have a fun show with uh, Stefan Didak. If you guys have never gotten to hang out with Stefan and hear from him, um, he's the head of uh, notblowingsmoke.org. He's the guy that we give all of our money to. Uh, really good guy. Uh, really, knowledge really knowledgeable. It'll be fun to talk to him about what's going on with Cole Bishop and what's going on in San Francisco. So good times to get the skinny in, on what's really going on in the community. Uh, go check out Adore E-Liquid. Go check out Vaping Swag. Go check out Omegadon. Omegadoneliquid.com. Uh, who else? Who else? Go check out that Ogbape Templar RDA, everybody. Go check it out. It's a fantastic RDA. Cheap. It's 30 bucks. Yeah. That's all I got, man. That's all I got. Meter's not here to, not, meter's not here to take us out proper like so. Hi, back. I, okay, wait. Go and check out the Pink Pussy list because I'm Leaf of Apes and I'm awesome and I have a really cool YouTube channel that you should go check out also. And a Patreon. And a Patreon if you want to support me. It would be great. I I go live like four, for like five or six days a week um, over on my channel. I do juice reviews all the time. Uh, what else does Life do? Uh, he's not. Face off. Yep. He does vape his face off. Vape your face off was today, right? Yeah, so he didn't have one today. I don't think. No vape your face off today. So tomorrow, everybody, go check out. Uh, go check out. Go check it out tomorrow. Should be fun. Should be an awesome show over on the uh, Life of Apes channel. Uh, I have a sweet beard. Bye, Lifea. Bye, Lifea. <laughs> I have a sweet beard. Um, I'm one of the nicest guys you're ever going to run across. Life of Apes, everybody. Life of mm -hmm. Apes. Over to, over to uh, TJ at the Poopy Pants desk. Live from the Poopy Pants desk. That's right. Um, first and foremost, thank you, everyone, for showing up. Um, thank you, those of you who did hang out with us tonight. Do appreciate it. Love you all. Um, Life of you're not here. Hesh, you're not here. Uh, thanks for showing up. You know you guys get it out early. Understand life happens, probably fucking Spain in the way. Um, first thing I do want to see is uh, say is that apparently I finally made it to the big time on um, Instagram because I got I don't know if this will show up. Um, big Lo Big Lou, fucking following me over on the Instagrams. Yeah. Don't know how the fuck that happened. Uh, either way, bleaker. I was like, oh shit. Apparently, I need to start putting more pictures of mech mods up. Um, yeah. You can't be a leader all the time. Sometimes you have to follow someone else. You had just happened to be the one you followed this time. Uh, that's it. Apparently, I, <laughs> I got lucky. Uh, what are you going to do? Uh, so, as you guys always know, first and foremost, make sure you guys are supporting. Adore you, Liquid. Look at this. God damn, that new camera is clear. It's fucking ridiculous. God damn, that's clear. I don't like it because it's going to make some things look really bad. Uh, it makes it easier to run shows. Uh, it does. Um, so make sure you guys go and fill your carts with little purple hearts because Dawn supports us. We need to support her as well. We love you, Dawn. We love you, Dawn. I love you more than anybody. Also, I'm going to punch you. I'm going to punch anybody that says anything different. No, he don't. This is something. Oh, Jesse, I'm so going to punch you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm some... kind of scared of that because I don't, I don't, I don't know where that punch is gonna go. You guys need to go check this out as yeah, well. I'm, I'm a, 
I'm now that you now that you've met me in person, you do know how little I am. You know, you know where straight ahead's going. I shouldn't say stuff like that because it's you're you're like right at the right angle to get a good taint shot. <laughs> no, just like that. <laughs> oh, what was that? I don't know, but it lifted him up about two foot in the air. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> also, go check this one out over at um, Omageddon Duck Pond. Duck, God damn it. Now I got to figure out how to get this thing to. Hey, there we go. Now I did it. I'm learning. Nice. Go check that stuff out. It's fucking phenomenal. I blew through it in just a couple of days. And while you're over there, you should probably go get yourself some of this Bali song. Because this stuff is phenomenal too. And fuck you, autofocus. Apparently, this is going to be the bane of my existence now. Uh, you, get a, you can get a controller and turn it off if you want. Yeah, that's the thing that sucks about that camera. I don't like focusing that well, as well as other some other ones. But it, if you hold it up there for five minutes, it will do it. <laughs> or, you just, or, you, or you just download the, the webcam controller and turn off autofocus. And then you can just hold everything up. Like, yeah, true. I mm, could do that too. Uh, also, um, it's automatically clear. That's right. Don't forget vaping swag. Um, we did see him in the comments tonight, so he is still alive. Contrary. Go so check out Jennifer Jarvis's one shots. That's right. Jennifer Jarvis has those wonderful one shots as well. And you can also go check out um, <coughs> coil vapes. Get some of this one, or maybe that one, or them two, or Bull of Joy, or anything else from there. Actually. Um, if you weren't paying attention, uh, Coil Vapes, they did do a limited release today of some uh, PB Moose. And um, huh. what was the other one? Fuck. I can't remember for the life of me now. But there is a limited release going on there. Um, so go check them out. And it is going to have the old school labels on them. Other than that, I don't have anything else that I'm really feel the need to pimp out except for fucking it's always black friday at yeti wire even though yeti can't be here i will still fully support him other than that i don't think i have anything else to say freddy's out there go check out clean as fuck coils he's yeah. got these series on or who's not there black cat white face court jans station juan castillo that's right oh speaking of court jans happy birthday court if you're watching this happy on the replay buddy birthday to the army buddy that's right i got nothing else for you guys tonight other than the norm you know the deal educate advocate not for yourselves not for the person to your left or to your right but for that person that comes behind us because they haven't made the switch yet okay well thank you guys for coming out what a wonderful time again as always i will see you guys next week no more shitty camera from now on pray that's right. Um, so who wants to take us out since we don't have a um, scheduled person to take us out tonight? Remember, everybody, as you go through your week, make sure you go and buy some Adore e-liquid and get off your butts and vape. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye.